Hey guys, so the question is, can you root all Android versions and all Android models with one single file? So Android has many models and versions and it has many rooting methods but can you do it with one file? In this method, I'm going to tell you how to do it without any data loss. Meaning that if you follow this method step by step, you won't lose a single data or apps or any files. So this method is 100% safe. So I'm going to throw you another question at you. Can you use all those apps which requires root? Yes, you can. You can use Snapchat, Pokemon Go or any kind of banking app with this method pretty easily. How? You may ask yourself or you can ask me. Watch till the end of the video and follow every step carefully. Warning. Rooting your phone will void all warranty support and I won't be responsible for any of your damages you do to your device. So the first thing you have to do is to unlock your bootloader. There's a ton of Android phones out there and each one of them has different unlocking methods. Just go through Google and search how to unlock bootloader of my and write down your device model. There is almost 90% chance that you will find a post or a video to unlock your phone. In this video, for an example, I'm going to use my OnePlus 5T. I'm going to go ahead and go to OnePlus community and there is a full step-by-step -step tutorial on how to unlock my OnePlus 5T. So I'm going to go ahead and follow that and unlock my bootloader. So the next step is downloading TWRP recovery. I'm going to go ahead and uh, search on the Google with uh, TWRP for OnePlus 5T and you can see that there will be uh, tons of results. I'm going to go ahead and uh, click on the official TWRP website which is on the first one I'm going to go ahead and click it and I'm going to go ahead and download the latest TWRP recovery while you are watching this video if you like it and if you want more can you videos please hit the subscribe button like it and comment down below if you have any other questions this is a new channel and I will be grateful for your help. So let's start again. Uh, so go ahead in the description box below and download Magisk. This is the one file that you need to root all your Android phones. Just go ahead and type in Magisk for your Android version which can be Pi, KitKat, Jellybean, anything and uh, scroll down and click the download here and this will take you to another page in this page you will see a list of all the supported versions of android you just go down download the latest stable version and also make sure that you download the latest uninstaller and latest magic manager for future use you would need the latest latest uninstaller for uninstalling magic or unrooting your phone if something happens down the road now what you have to do is you have to take that magic file that you downloaded and also the magic uninstaller and the latest magic manager and plug in your phone and copy them in your internal storage next what you have to do is you have to flash your TWP recovery and you have to boot into your bootloader screen to boot into your bootloader screen press the power button and turn off, turn off your phone and then 
press the volume up button and power button simultaneously for 5 seconds and you will be in the bootloader screen. In the bootloader screen, plug in your phone and uh, uh, there is the folder that you are seeing right now is in the description box below. Open that folder and put your TWRP recovery.img file into this folder and then press the shift key and right click on the screen and then select PowerShell and then there will be a PowerShell window open up and then from there type in the words that are showing in the screen right now also remember guys you have to put the .img after the twrp file name in the powershell console now press enter to flash twrp recovery successfully onto your phone After you have flashed it, you have to go to the TWRP recovery. So how can you go there? So you have to first power off your phone. And uh, the method is volume, press volume down and then press power button simultaneously for 5 to 8 seconds. When you are in the TWRP recovery section, press the install to install a file. Select the magic file that you downloaded and swipe to flash. It will flash and install itself automatically onto your phone. You don't have to do it, do anything here and then when it's finished press the reboot button to reboot. After this you go to your magic manager app. It has many useful and good features. From here you can hide whatever apps you want, you can hide Pokemon Go or Snapchat that doesn't allow rooted smartphones to use them, you can also hide any banking apps you want, you can also go ahead and download any kind of modules you want, you can go ahead and uh, install small departure from the last video that I have explained briefly, you can click the card here, go and watch the video that explains step by step uh, how to how you can patch your framework.jar and you can get you can get to spoof forever if you enjoyed this video don't forget to hit the subscribe button below and if you liked it feel free to share with your friends and also give it a big thumbs up Thank you.